Hey everybody, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. This is Elijah. If you guys haven't seen him or don't follow me on social media or Snapchat, this is my son. He is 10 months old. He's getting so big. And I figured now would be the perfect time to film an update video while he's a little calm. He is getting very sleepy, so we'll see what we can do. So I'm not entirely sure when the last time you guys saw him if you don't follow me on Snapchat, which I'll have linked somewhere in the video. I want to say it was one of my review videos which I'll link down below and he was like four months at the time maybe so it's been a while since I did a video with him in it and a lot has changed including his fascination with phones. He is not walking yet but he does crawl really fast and he stands with assistance. He's always using things to lift himself up and stand and he uses my legs and he uses pretty much anything that he can to get himself in the standing position which I think is really good. I'm not trying to rush him to do anything yet. He will do it all on his own time. He's starting to hand me objects now so if I ask him for something I'll be like Elijah can I have it and he will hand it to me like this cookie I just gave him. Here look watch. Can I have it? Can I have it? Thank you. He's a very curious and very active boy. Like a typical boy, he is all over the place. He's rough, he is just crazy. He's always screaming and just enjoying life. He loves sleeping. He sleeps about 12 hours, 12 to 13 hours a night. And he sleeps completely through the night now, which is awesome. He also takes two naps throughout the day, and normally they're at least an hour each, but sometimes it's more, sometimes it's less. He still loves music. I'm always playing him music, and he loves theme songs to shows. Like, he'll watch shows long enough just for the theme song, and then that's pretty much it. Um, but he does like Mickey Mouse Clubhouse and Miles from Tomorrowland, those two things he really, really enjoys. Are you going to eat the cookie, or are you going to keep handing it to me? You gotta eat it. There you go. He also eats a lot. Like, he loves eating. That's how I'm getting him to stay calm right now is by giving him a cookie because he will eat all day, every day if he could. He loves solid foods. I mean, he's still, oh, you are drooling all over the place. He still eats baby food, but I am starting to give him finger foods now, like this cookie that is just the messiest thing that you can give a baby. But he does eat a lot. I feed him three meals a day of actual food. I am still breastfeeding, so in between those three meals of solid foods, I will breastfeed him and give him snacks. He wants to talk now too. Let's see, he does have two bottom teeth. I'm not entirely sure if there's more coming in yet, but he has had, I don't want it. You eat it. No, you eat it. Um, he has had two bottom teeth for a long time, uh, probably a, a couple months now, so now he is just waiting for his other teeth to come in because he just loves chewing food. The only thing is he is on the smaller side for his age, so he's about 16 pounds and 26 inches, um, so he is on the lowest side of the spectrum of the growth chart, so we are... Why are you screaming? He wants to talk, that's how he talks. We are considering supplementing for these next few months because my plan is to breastfeed and continue breastfeeding and feeding him foods and solids until he is one and then I can switch over to milk and whole milk. So for now, I am gonna keep breastfeeding but we are considering supplementing maybe like a bottle a day of formula just so that he can gain a little bit more. Obviously he loves to scream. He also will mimic screams. I don't wanna do that on camera because it can get very loud. But if you follow me on Snapchat, I usually do that on there with him. So be sure you do that. You don't want the pacifier? No? That's it? Okay, so that's pretty much everything that's been going on with me and him. If I can think of anything else, I'll let you guys know or you guys can ask questions down below and let me know like what you're curious about. As far as some favorites that we have been loving, he loves bananas and mashed potatoes. He will die for some bananas and mashed potatoes. He also loves these cookies. These are the Graduates Ever Roots. First, baby's first cookie. He dies for them. That's what he was screaming for just now. Can I talk? No? Can I have that? Thank you. Now, can you eat it? 
Um, I try to give him fruits and vegetables most of the day and then just have these for little snacks because he will sit there and eat like 10 of them if he could. He also really likes to flip things. It's like a thing with him where he will constantly flip a card you give him or a book or a piece of cardboard. Anything that's flat, he will flip that, including my phone. I don't know why, it's like a quirk of his. And then he's also super obsessed with phones and remotes now, so he loves my phone. He loves playing with the remotes and just throwing them on the ground like a typical boy. Um, so that's just something that he's been obsessed with. I am still using the teething necklace. I use it as a bracelet on him because that's what works best. I can just leave it on his wrist and don't have to take it off unless I'm giving him a bath. I don't have to worry about it being around his neck overnight or anything and he barely notices that it's there. And I have to say that since he's been wearing the teething necklace, I rarely feel like he's in pain from his teething and he also does not drool nearly as much as he used to. He used to go through bibs, he doesn't do that and I've been having him wear this bracelet for the longest um, but I actually started wearing it properly probably a few months ago. I didn't realize at the beginning that you weren't supposed to take it off. You were supposed to keep it on them as much as possible. So I feel like since I started wearing it or putting it on him correctly, he hasn't really drooled that much. I also have one mommy favorite for me. If you guys want a whole separate video on our favorites and mommy favorites, please let me know down below. But I did want to mention that I have noticed liquid lipsticks have been a lifesaver when I want to do makeup because he will attack my face and attack my lips, especially if there's a color on them. He likes to touch my lips and just pinch them and do everything that babies love to do. I really feel like liquid lipsticks stay the best and the longest on me when he does that. But pretty much that's everything that's been going on with him and with me. I am still my pre-pregnancy weight. I am gaining a little bit of like extra-ness that I don't want on my stomach. I do plan on losing that little extra-ness that I did gain. But other than that, I haven't really had any issues. Uh, my recovery went really well. I did, I guess, start losing hair at some point because now I have a whole lot of baby hairs up here that are very, very short. But other than that, nothing really has changed. If you have any questions about any of that, please let me know down below and I'll be sure to answer those questions for you. But for now, that is it. I really hope you guys enjoyed this quick little update video. I really just wanted to get on here with him, show you how big he is and how, like, awesome and just crazy he is and I wanted to update you guys on how he's been doing and how we've been doing in the past 10 months. If you want to see more mommy vlogs and update videos like this, please let me know in a comment down below and give this a big old thumbs up. But for now, follow us on all our social medias, which I will link somewhere on the screen so you guys can stay updated on mine and his life. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Say bye! Yay! Say bye!